yes, school holidays are finally over, which means I now have more time and the place to myself so I can start making more proper videos again. Um, which, like, I have been waiting for the last two weeks because I've had so much that I wanted to say and just, I can't make videos when there's heaps of people around and all this noise and I just, like, I, I can't do it. It's like the embarrassment thing and just trying to concentrate. It's, it's no good. So, now that I finally have that breathing space, I'm gonna be trying to make some more videos, um, just to get back onto all those things that I was saying last time, you know, I've got so much in my head that I want to get out. And also I was scrolling through, you know, some of my older videos on YouTube and I'm just like, wow, once I deleted all those things in that big purge ages ago, most of my videos are just sort of ho-hum and I've got too many where I've gone out and filmed gigs and I kind of don't want my channel to be that. I, I mean, I needed those things to be able to show people stuff, but I want more of me and my thoughts. I just need to get my thoughts out of my head, otherwise they drive me crazy. So I'm gonna try hard to be a good little YouTuber like they're always telling me to be, which, yeah, I'll, I'll do my best, but there's some things I'm not gonna give a crap about. like. Yeah, uh, but you know, I have been watching um, a little bit of Simon Whistler, um, he did some masterclass on some stuff, and some of that actually seems like it might help me get back on top of things, so I'm going to be trying to do that. Um, I've also been sort of mapping out some of the things that I want to do, that I want to talk about, because, you know, sometimes, sometimes I sit down to make a video and there's just so many things I want to talk about that it's like, where do I even start? So I've been trying to plan things out a little bit more. That does mean sometimes though, if I'm making a video, I might be like looking at this, in which case, like if I'm st sitting there for ages going, what was I gonna say? I might cut those bits out. So you may see some more jump cuts here and there. I'm not sure because I haven't filmed any yet. So I can't tell you how that's gonna go. But I will do my best not to jump cut around like Hank Green or that um, video I did for my class months back, um, which is just like all over the place. I'm gonna try not to do that because I think that's just not, that's just not me. I'm more of a rambler. I will try to keep the rambly feel going. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I wanna try and get on top of things a little bit better. So yes, I have been mapping out a few things. Let's go through the plan just quickly. So um, the next two videos, uh, I'm probably going to talk about a couple of like updates to my life, like more in depth, because there are, well, there's one big thing that's happened in my life, which I'll probably do the next video. And then the one after that is sort of a minor thing, but that's kind of interesting and had me thinking about stuff. And then what was the other one? The one after that, oh, probably going back to revisit some depression stuff. And then after that, um, you know, I mentioned I was just going to go on a bunch of rants. So I've had a request for a particular rant, but when I've been looking at what I want to rant about in that topic, it might go on for a few more videos instead of just being one video, because there's so many, for every topic, there's always like these little subtopics. So I'm kind of thinking, do I do a series of rants on one topic or is that a little bit too boring? Should I drop in some other things and like break it up? I'm not sure. If you have an opinion about that, let me know. I guess like probably breaking it up is a bit better because also that just gives me more time to think about what else I'm, I want to talk about that fits into that topic. Um, also, whether you want playlists so that you can just look at the things you're interested in. I don't know. Let me know if that's what you want. Um, also, Yes, uh, I've had that video request. I've also got other things I want to talk about. But if you have a request, especially if you're one of my patrons on Patreon, just send me a message and like, I'm not going to cover every topic. I had another request that I've had to say like, kind of no, because it's not my area of expertise and not somewhere I want to be an expertise. I want to be an expert on. Um, but if you send me a request, I will think about it and it may come in a video at some point. Um, yeah, but I also have so much stuff that I've just been, like the last two weeks I haven't been able to make videos, so I have been just, every time I have a thought, oh I want to make a video about that, I've been trying to write it up in a little thing just in dot points, so hopefully I get back to all of that. So yeah, but the next three, three or four videos I think I've got a plan for, um, and yeah, I'll try to do that every Wednesday. Um, get back onto that old schedule because I think that's what I was trying to do before is like upload every Wednesday But um, of course uni and life stuff kind of got in the way But now I don't have so much of that going on. 
So hopefully, let's try and be a good little YouTuber with a schedule. Um, although, with like sillier videos, you know, like where I'm doing that headphone singing, if I do shit like that, maybe I'll put that off schedule, like just drop them whenever. Um, I'll try and make Wednesday be a decent upload instead of just nonsense. Um, so yeah, I don't know, let me know what you think about that. Um, speaking of those little extra videos, I had a question recently about why I haven't been doing those midnight musing videos, and I gotta tell you, it's because I haven't really been up at midnight. Um, in the next... I think in the next video I'll talk a bit about something that's happened in my life, but basically I'm trying to become a morning person. So I've been going to bed, uh, I think most nights I'm getting to bed at around 11, which is like, I'm doing really well with that. It's, it's, yes, we are making progress with this. Um, because as you know, I had melancholic depression, which is the one that like really destroys your mornings. Um, and so I've been trying to become more of a morning person and it's actually happening. I, I am making progress on that, finally, my goodness. And we've just switched over to daylight savings here in Australia, or at least in my state. Um, so, you know, like getting up early, you get more daylight, um, and I probably need more daylight. I need to stop staying in my room all the time. Um, and then of course, as summer goes on, the nights are gonna get longer with more light anyway. So. Yeah, just trying to make more out of daytime. Um, I know I can do things at night, but the thing is, today I'm able to make videos earlier than I usually would, which means I can probably make a few videos today if I really try. Um, just because I'm up earlier, I'm starting earlier, and you know, there's a set time that people start coming home and then I can't make videos anymore. So yeah, I think like waking up early is probably going to be a good thing. And even yesterday, um, every Sunday I clean. Since I came back from Japan, every Sunday I clean my room and like fold my laundry and um, have a shower and you know, clean my bathroom and look after Hopi and all this kind of stuff. So yesterday I actually got all of that done before midday and then I was able to go out in the afternoon to visit a music friend and work on some stuff. So yeah, like just in terms of fitting in with normal people schedules instead of just my schedule, getting up earlier has been a good thing. So that's why there's no more midnight musings. I mean, I kind of did stop doing them just because I was busy, but then now as I have more time, I've been working on getting up earlier. So I'm just usually not awake at midnight anymore. Like maybe one day in the last month or I don't even know how long. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, that's why there's no midnight musings if you were enjoying them. Um, I think that's all I've got to say in this video. Uh, actually, one more thing is like I have looked into getting webcams so I can make videos more often, but um, it seems like kind of disappointing. I was watching uh, someone do a review and a comparison of different webcams and they're all really crap quality. And I just don't understand it, you know, like technology has come so far and no one can make a decent webcam. That just, that just blows my mind. So I'm stuck with my phone, um, and you know, I'm not gonna get one of those fancy cameras because I don't have the money. Um, and it just, like, this phone's fine. The quality is better than I get on a webcam and it's cheaper than having to try and find proper camera and proper lighting and I don't know. I mean, the lighting here is all right. Uh, today it's kind of gloomy outside, so, but the, the, the phone seems to be adjusting fine. So we'll deal with that. We'll deal with this camera. But if you do have a recommendation for webcams, just like send it through to me. Um, especially if you've got like one of those videos where someone's doing a comparison, um, that'd probably help me out. But for the moment, I think I'm just stuck with this phone and see the problem you might be wondering is why don't you just film every day on the phone? Okay. So I could film every day on the phone. But I've had this, it's a Galaxy S7 Edge. I've had it for about two years. It's actually my first smartphone. Um, some of you know that already. Um, but yes, I've had it for about two years. And so the little plug where you plug in the charger, which is also the data cable, it's starting to get a bit dodgy. So like even when I'm charging it, I have to put a particular way to make sure it charges. And I think I've not been doing that right because it seems to be charging a bit slower. Or maybe that's a battery problem, I don't know. But when I plug it into my computer to get all the video off it so that I can, you know, check it, edit if it needs editing, um, and then upload it to YouTube. Um, 
it's it's hard because I have to make sure that the plugs are just so so that the data will travel through and it's it's a pain in the butt so that's why that's one of the things that's slowing me down um, and I have bought a new cable since the one that I got with this and it's I think it's actually the plug on the phone that is having problems so at some point if it gets really bad I'm gonna have to take my phone into like one of those Samsung places and just be like is this fixable and um, we will see how that goes um, yeah pain in the butt trying to get video off it so yeah and I mean I can edit inside the phone with its own thing but it's so hard to like get things where you want them to be and it's just a pain in the butt and then when it renders the video it's always this massive file size whereas if I do it on my computer I do have that HitFilm Express but that's the one that gets some of the judders into my footage and it takes a while and sometimes my computer struggles with it because my computer is this Windows 7 thing from 2011 it's getting a little bit dodgy um so usually I actually still edit on Windows Movie Maker, which I think it might even be the Windows XP version, I'm not sure. I've like kept bringing it across from operating system to operating system. So like I think I had to do some fancy stuff to get it to work on Vista on my old computer. And then I had to bring it over to Windows 7 because there was also Windows Movie Maker 2.6, which is crap. And then there's that Windows Live Movie Maker, which is also crap. So I've been using this older version of Windows Movie Maker. And I like it. It's really good. It's really easy. Um, my computer is struggling a bit, so I just have to make sure I save after each edit. But it always reopens quite quickly if anything happens. Um, yeah, it's just like when you make a cut, it has to think about it a bit before you can play again. But no big deal, no big deal. The thing that's really cool about it is it's so old that it can't do more than 25 frames a second, which means the file size is lower. And also it's a Windows movie file, so the file size is lower. And the important thing about making my file size smaller is, I mean, on the one hand, I doubt most of my viewers can see, like, these minute quality issues. Um, you know, 25 frames a second versus 30, it's not that much. I mean, I still watch DVDs because my eyesight's crap. Like, I can't tell the difference between DVD quality and Blu-ray half the time. Like, I'd probably have to get close and be like, hey, what's the difference between DVD? Um, and just be a freak like that. Um, no, the thing that is really important about low file size is I live in Australia and our internet is, like, it's decent. My, um, we've got cable internet and I think we're going to have to move on to NBN, but hopefully we get the same speeds. But, like, Australian internet just isn't great. And even on our um, cable internet... The maximum speed to upload is, um, I think, 5 megabits per second, and I like to make long videos, so <laughs> yeah, smaller file size is better. So there's all these things that are slowing down my ability to make videos. But anyway, long ramble, like this is the stuff that I'm saying, I didn't even write on this. Of course, so like I've made plans, of course I'm going to go on tangents, that's just how I am, but at least I have a general plan of all the things that I want to say, and I'll try and make as many videos as I can and get onto a more regular schedule. Um, I think we'll just try once a week because, yeah, all these other issues are slowing me down. But at least if I can record the videos, um, if I can record a bunch, then I can edit a bunch, and then I can just queue them up to upload and, you know, get them scheduled. And then if I miss a day, it's going to be easier, right? I mean, I know you guys are all quite forgiving, but I want to try for myself to be a good little YouTuber. And I really should try not try to stop swearing if I ever want to be monetized again. But uh, I don't know. Monetization was never much good. If you really want to support me in that way, um, come join my Patreon. It's like one dollar a month, and you get access to all this extra stuff. I try and do like a goodies upload every month, and then I also have some extra stuff going on there, which is sometimes public, sometimes patrons only. But anyway, one of these days I'll make a proper video for Patreon. But right now I want to focus on just making my YouTube better. And talking about some of the stuff I need to get out of my head, because if it doesn't get out of my head, I go a bit crazy. Um, you know, like, I think I was talking to Dad about this. He was like, why do you have to? And I'm like, I have to! I have to get shit out of my head. If I don't 
get it. Oh, I must have been talking to someone else as well. But like, the thing is, if I don't get stuff out of my head, I don't care if no one watches or if no one reads my Facebook post or whatever. I just need to get it out there where someone can see it. And then for some reason, as long as someone can see it, I feel better and I can chill. Anyway, that's all for now. Um, goodness, it's raining outside again. We've had so much rain lately. But, yes, I will upload this. I was going to, like, maybe do two uploads this week, but this video ended up going a lot longer. Like, I thought it was just going to be a short, hey, guys, here's the plan. But no, of course, I've already gone for, what does it say, 15 minutes. So I guess this will be this week's video, and then next week we'll start with all the other stuff. Um, but I'll try and film as much as I can, and if I end up filming heaps, maybe I'll do more than, more than once a week, but we'll see. I don't want to get too ambitious. I've got a few things going on, and I just need to pace myself. I need to pace myself. Like, this time three years ago, when I got, started getting depressed again, I just had so much going on. And, uh, that's just something I need to do. <clears throat> I just need to make sure I don't burn out again, because, yeah. Anyway. Anyway, let us stop for now, and I will see you next week, I guess. Cool.